suspicion of proximity, Indasala cave, Payayoga cave, apposition of comparison, golden colored, with a bull's gate, apposition of majority, Paytumasara Brahmin village, apposition of distinction, diamond ring, and so on. 3. Collective concept, Samadhana P, e.g., eight footed, pile of riches. 4. Additive concept, Dipanikita P, e.g., one, two, three. 5. Very similar concept, Tajapi refers to the individual essence of a given Dhamma, e.g., earth, fire, hardness, heat. 6. Continuity concept, Santati P refers to the length of continuity of life, e.g., octogenarian, nonagenarian. In the second set, there are a concept according to function, Kikapi, e.g., preacher, expounder of Dhamma. B. Concept according to shape, Sayahanapi, e.g. thin, stout, round, square. C. Concept according to gender, Liagap. e.g. female, male. D. Concept according to location, Bomipi, e.g. of the sense sphere, Kosalan. E. Concept as proper name, Pakatap. e.g. Tissa, Naga, Simana which are making known, appellations, by mere name. Making F. Concept of the unformed, asayo ketapanati. E.g. cessation, nibbana, etc., which make the unformed dhamma known, an existent concept. From commentary to pugalapanati, condensed, see also DHSA 390F. All this shows that the word panati carries the meanings of either appellation or concept or both together, and that no English word quite corresponds. 12. But since the object is stated with individual essences, the breakup of states with individual essences, their destruction, their fall, all that has to do only with states with individual essences. Hence the Blessed One said, Pikhas, aging and death is impermanent, formed, dependently arisen. S226. If it cannot reach absorption because of its object being states with individual essences, then what about the supermundane yahanas and certain of the immaterial yahanas? It was to answer this that he said now with special development they supermundane yahana and so on, visum MH 243. Kajio yahana, for example, has a concept, panati, as its object, 4.29 and a concept is a dhamma without individual essence, a subhavid hamma. 13. In the Ao Gatara text the negative and positive clauses are in the opposite order. 14. Agaru, Alos, not so spelled in ped, but see Agalu. 15. Hatthesayo Kalika, the fingers of a pair of clasped hands, a row of fingers, Ao Gilapanti, Visum MH 246. 16. For the penetration of the characteristic of foulness, for the observation of repulsiveness as the individual essence, visum MH 246. 17. The higher consciousness is a term for yahana. 18. Visum MH explains sati sati ayatane, rendered hereby whenever there is occasion with tasmi e tasmi e pabe hetu a diagra o sati. When there is this or that reason consisting in a previous cause, etc., MA4146 says, Sati Sati Karao. Kim Pan at the Karao and Ti. Abina VA Karao I, whenever there is a reason. But what is the reason here? The direct knowledge itself is the reason. Dot. 19 Arihaka as a plant is not in PED, CCPD, Sin Panela UA. 20 There are various readings. 21 Galavaka, here rendered by nape of the neck which the context demands. But elsewhere, e.g. 4.47, 8.110, base of the neck seems indicated, that is, where the neck fits onto the body, or gullet. 22 A measure of length, as much as a louse's head. 23 Nisada Poda, rolling pin, equals Sila Puteka, Visum MH 250, what is meant is probably the stone roller, thicker in the middle than at the ends, with which curry spices, etc., are normally rolled by hand on a small stone slab in Sri Lanka today. 24 Kohanai, 
shoulder blade bones, for koha, equals flat, cf kohalika 97, the meaning is demanded by the context, otherwise no mention would be made of these two bones, and the description fits. Pet under this ref. Has stomach bone. Should one read Atikayo, blunt, or Atikyo? Very sharp. 25. Dutakata, badly paired, Takita, pages of Takati to pair, e.g. with an ads, not in ped, CMI 31124, 3166. 26. Panjara, frame, not quite in this sense in ped. 27. Sakuatagapiwa Parlakayata, a piece of curled up toffee flake. The Sinhalese translation suggests the following readings and resolution, say Okathita, thickened or boiled down, rather than Sakuata, curled up, Gadapua, toffee. Full of ghee, pala, flake or slab, Kayata, piece, dot, the color of Dukula, muslin, rags. As to shape, it is the shape of its location. As to direction, they. 28 Kilomaka, Midriff, the rendering is obviously quite inadequate for what is described here, but there is no appropriate English word. 29 Abhaga, looped, not in this sense in ped, see Abhanjati, xi.64 in ped. 30 Dakasatalika, not in ped, rendered in Sinhalese translation by Helmeli. White edible water lily. 31 Mazaka Sambupali Vihanaki Lihapavara. Puffakasa this is rendered into Sinhalese by Kyaumas Kasa of Alapurana Kadek. Pup, an inflated piece, or bag, of cloth, which has wrapped rotten meat refuse. In Ped Pavara is given as cloak, mantle, and, this ref, as the mango tree, but there seems to be no authority for the rendering mango tree which has nothing to do with this context. Puffaka, balloon, is not in ped, cf common Burmese spelling of bubu a, bubble, as puffu a. 32 It would be a mistake to take the renderings of these worms' names too literally. Jayadupada, boil-producing worm, appears only as earthworm in ped, which will not do here. The more generally accepted reading seems to take potentuka and sutaka, tapeworm and threadworm, as two kinds rather than pot and sutaka, neither is in ped. 33 Qoapa, orger, ped only gives the meaning corpse, which does not fit the meaning either here or, e.g., at xi.21, where the sense of a dead body is inappropriate. 34 Kaduyati, to itch, the verb is not in ped, see Kaidu. 35 Upadioa, clung to, cch 14, note 23. 36 references sometimes made to the hand grasping question, Hathagahakapanha. It may be to this, but there is another mentioned at the end of the commentary to the Dativibhoga. 37 The allusion seems to be to the basis of mastery, Abhibhayadana, or better, basis for transcendence, CM2L3 and MA3257F, but C60. 38 Some is said with reference to the inmates of the Uttara, Northern. Monastery in an Aradapura, Visam MH 256. 39 The words in all its aspects refer to the 16 bases, for these are only found in total in this dispensation. When outsiders know mindfulness of breathing they only know the first four modes, Visam MH 257. 40 The ascetic is a stream enterer, the second ascetic is a once returner, the third ascetic is a non returner, the fourth ascetic is an arohant. MA24. 41K, wild, ped, this ref. Gives useless, which misses the point. CF MA282, 4198. 42 The nine kinds of abode, resting place, are the forest and the root of a tree already mentioned, and a rock, a hill cleft, a mountain cave, a charnel ground, a jungle thicket, an open space, a heap of straw. MI 181. 43 In the hot season the forest is favorable, in the cold season the root of a tree, in the rainy season an empty place. For one of phlegmatic humor, phlegmatic by nature, the forest is favorable, for one of bilious humor the root of a tree, 
for one of windy humor an empty place. For one of deluded temperament the forest, for one of hating temperament the root of a tree, for one of greedy temperament an empty place, Visum MH 258. 44 The amplification is from Visum MH 258. 45 Regarded as particles, as a number of groups, Kalapa, Visum MH 259. This conception of the occurrence of breaths is based on the theory of motion as successive arisings in adjacent locations, Desantarapati, see note 54 below. For group CXX.2F. 46 Zeal arises, additional zeal, which is profitable and has the characteristic of desire to act, arises due to the satisfaction obtained when the meditation has brought progressive improvement. More subtle than before, more subtle than before the already described zeal arose, for the breaths occur more subtly owing to the meditation's influence in tranquilizing the body's distress and disturbance. Gladness arises, fresh happiness arises of the kinds classed as minor, etc., which is the gladness that accompanies the consciousness occupied with the meditation and is due to the fact that the peacefulness of the object increases with the growing subtlety of the breaths and to the fact that the meditation subject keeps to its course. The mind turns away, the mind turns away from the breaths, which have reached the point at which their manifestation needs investigating, C-177, owing to their gradually increasing subtlety. But some say, see PSA CE, P-351 it is when the in-breaths and out-breaths have reached a subtler state owing to the influence of the meditation and the counterpart sign, for when that has arisen, the mind turns away from the normal breaths. Equanimity is established, when concentration, classed as access and absorption, has arisen in that counterpart sign, then, since there is no need for further interest to achieve yahana, onlooking, equanimity, ensues, which is specific neutrality, visum MH 260. 47 In these nine ways, that occur in the nine ways just described. Long in-breaths and out-breaths are a body, the in-breaths and out-breaths, which exist as particles though they have the aspect of length, constitute a body in the sense of a mass. And here the sign that arises with the breaths as its support is also called in-breath and out-breath. CFEG 206, the establishment, foundation, is mindfulness, mindfulness is called establishment, foundation, yupahana, since it approaches, yupagantva the object and remains, tahati, there. The contemplation is knowledge, contemplation of the sign by means of serenity, and contemplation of mentality materiality by defining with insight the in-breaths and out-breaths in the body, which is their support as materiality and the consciousness and the states associated with it as the immaterial, mentality, or knowledge, in other words, awareness of what is actually there, has actually become. The body is the establishment, foundation, there is that body, and mindfulness approaches it by making it its object and remains there, thus it is called establishment. And the words the body is the establishment include the other, the mental, kind of body too since the above mentioned comprehension by insight is needed here too. But it is not the mindfulness, that body is not called mindfulness though it is called the establishment. Mindfulness is both the establishment, foundation, and the mindfulness, being so both in the sense of remembering, sarana, and in the sense of establishing, yupadahana. By means of that mindfulness, by means of that mindfulness already mentioned, and that knowledge, and the knowledge already mentioned, that body, that in-breath and out-breath, body and that material body which is its support. He contemplates, Anupasati, he keeps re-seeing, Anu Anupasati, with Yahana knowledge and with insight knowledge. That is why. Development of the foundation, establishment, of mindfulness consisting in contemplation of the body as a body is said, in virtue of that contemplation this is said to be development of the foundation, establishment, of mindfulness consisting in contemplation of the body as a body of the kind already stated. What is meant is this the contemplation of the body as an in-breath and out. 
breath body as stated and of the physical body that is its material support, which is not contemplation of permanence, etc., in a body whose individual essence is impermanent, etc. Like the contemplation of a waterless mirage as water, but which is rather contemplation of its essence as impermanent, painful, not self, and foul, according as is appropriate, or alternatively, which is contemplation of it as a mere body only, by not contemplating it as containing anything that can be apprehended as I or mine or woman or man, all this is contemplation of the body. The mindfulness associated with that contemplation of the body, which mindfulness is itself the establishment, is the establishment. The development, the increase, of that is the development of the foundation, establishment, of mindfulness consisting in contemplation of the body. Visam MH 261 The compound Satipahana is derived by the Paisamhita from Sati, mindfulness, and Yupahana, establishment, Paisai 182, but in the commentaries the resolution into Sati and Pahana, foundation, is preferred. MAI 237-38, in the 118th Sutta of the Mahihima Nikaya the first tetrad is called development of the first foundation of mindfulness, or contemplation of the body. MN 10, DN 22, the object of the Paisamhita passage quoted is to demonstrate this. 48 The beginning, middle, and end are described in 197, and the way they should be treated is given in 199-201. What is meant is that the meditator should know what they are and be aware of them without his mindfulness leaving the tip of the nose to follow after the breaths inside the body or outside it, speculating on what becomes of them. 49 In the first part of the system, in the first part of the system of development, in the first two bases, is what is intended. Of course, a rousing of knowledge must be admitted to take place here too because of the presence of awareness of the length and shortness of the breaths as they actually are, as they actually become, and it is not hard to do that, for it is merely the taking account of them as they occur. That is why it is put in the present tense here. But what follows is as hard as for a man to walk on a razor's edge, which is why the future tense is used for the subsequent stages. In order to indicate the need for exceptional prior effort, Visam MH 263. 50 Bodily Formation, the in-breath and out-breath, CMI 301. For although it is consciousness originated, it is nevertheless called bodily formation since its existence is bound up with the Kamaborn body and it is formed with that as the means, Visam MH 263. 51 The faint sound itself as a sign is the sign of the faint sounds, it has that as its object. What is meant? Of course, the faint sounds have ceased too then, but the sign of the sounds has been well apprehended and so consciousness occurs with the sign of fainter sounds as its object. For as from the outset he ascertains with Yundi's tract consciousness the sign of each sound as it ceases, eventually his consciousness occurs in the end with the sign of ultra-subtle sounds too as its object, Visam MH 266. 52 is a meditation subject for a beginner is said with reference to the serenity, i.e. Hana, meditation subject, but the insight meditation subject applies to the other tetrads too, Visam MH 266. 53 Buffeted by wind, if he gives much attention to the wind that has gone inside, that place seems to him as if it were buffeted by the wind, as if filled with fat, Visam MH 268. No further explanation is given. 54 Following, Anugamana, is occurring along with, Anu Anu Pavitana, going after, Anugakana, by means of mindfulness through making the breaths the object as they occur. Hence he said, and that is not by following after the beginning, middle, and end. The navel is the beginning because of their first arising there. For the notion of a beginning, adi sinta, is here in the sense of first arising, not in the sense of just arising once only. For they actually go on arising throughout the whole length from the navel to the nose tip, and wherever they arise, there in that same place they dissolve, because there is no going, movement, of damas. The ordinary term motion, gatasamana, refers to successive arisings in adjacent locations, desantarapati.